So question number 34 is a binary operation question. It stated that if the binary operation this, which is an asterisk, is defined by m asterisk n. So wherever you have m asterisk n, it means m multiplied by n plus m plus n for any real numbers m and n. We're asked to find an identity, this identity element under the operation. So an identity, what does identity element does to a value? It doesn't change it. For example, under multiplication, if you have 2 multiplied by 1 is equal to 2, 3 multiplied by 1 is equal to 3. Under multiplication, whatever number you take, you multiply by 1 is still that number. Therefore, 1 is an identity under multiplication. And again, if you have uh, like 2 plus 0 is equal to 2, minus 2 plus 0 is equal to minus 2, and so on. Any number you take and add 0, it is the same thing as that number. Therefore, under um, addition, 0 is an identity. So we have so many of this. I don't have to waste time. Let us move on to this question. Suppose the identity is E. So if you should relate any number, M or N, with this identity, it will not change it. Suppose we have N asterisk E. It will remain N. It won't change. But what is the definition of this? Because we want to find the value of this E. From definition, we have learned that if you have M asterisk N, it is the same thing as MN plus M plus N. So now let us relate this with this. Therefore, this will be n multiplied by e, then plus, plus n, then finally plus e. And it must give us this same number n, because identity won't change it. So now let us collect the like terms by taking this to the right-hand side, leaving n e plus e equal to n minus n. We can factorize this. We have e in common n plus 1, this is equal to 0. So either e or n plus 1 is equal to 0. But our own goal is to find e. So let us set e to be equal to 0. Therefore, e is equal to 0, which is option D.